Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Jose Aldo versus Mario Bautista. Jose Aldo, 32 wins, 8 losses. He's 4-1 in his last 5 fights. That one loss is, is against Marab Duvall. really 2 years ago where neither guy did literally anything. Jose just kept defending takedowns. Plus 145 underdog, 38 years old, 5'7", 70 inch reach. Fighting Mario Bautista who's 14-2, minus 175 favorite, 31 years old. 5'9 with a 69 inch reach, 2 inches in height, 1 inch in reach for the legend Jose Aldo. This is an interesting one because if you watch Mario Bautista fight, I really, really like the urgency that he's consistently fighting with. I love the fact that he's always looking for a finish. I love the fact that he's always moving. His gas tank is virtually incredible. He was finished by Trevin Jones, who, when he was on, looked pretty damn good i mean he hit he hit uh mario batista with a nat one of the nasty most nastiest uppercuts i've seen beautiful switch uppercut it was it just just beauty i know trevor jones clearly didn't work out in the ufc but it's still the reality it's still true um you know and jose's been focusing a lot on boxing I i'm very curious to see how jose um handles Mario Batista consistently, like no matter what Jose does, unless he's able to find that shot to put him away, which he hasn't done in a long time. How does he do with somebody who just is just coming at him? You know, and there was moments when he fought and when he came back to the UFC in his last one against Jonathan Martinez, where Martinez would have these slight moments of success, and then Jose would capture the momentum right back. I don't think the moment's gonna get to Mario Bautista. I don't I don't think that's how that that, that goes. I think Jose Aldo is gonna come out and looking for his boxing. You got Mario Bautista who's gonna consistently making Jose Aldo work, throwing some strikes at him, throwing some kicks at him. Again, looking to grapple, looking to get his back, looking just to stay active, stay in his face. Luckily this is not a five round fight because then I think of the cardio of Amaro Batista could be an actual issue, but I'm just worried with this fight for Jose because of the fact that Mar Batista can could consistently just be going at Aldo and overwhelm him and just starting to break him down from each round. At first, in the first round, Aldo is gonna look great, but I think at some point Mario is gonna kind of turn these rounds away, and I think he steals a 29-28 decision and the biggest victory clearly of his career. I'm saying Mario Batista wins, but on fight day, I'm rooting for Jose Aldo. Just saying. As always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Put your pred predictions in the comment section. Let me know who you're picking. Peace.